So hydrochloric acid, or HCl, is made by our stomach and helps us break down our food so that we can access the nutrients in that food. And that HCl is also the acid barrier that keeps all these bad guys from coming in and setting up camp in the digestive tract. So it's not an accident. Mother Nature is not an idiot like advertisers like us to believe. And a lot of people who are experiencing symptoms that they think are from too much stomach acid are actually being caused by not having enough stomach acid. So once a person understands that, and they're looking to make steps to improve their body's ability to produce this hydrochloric acid correctly, they often want to understand, well, why isn't my body making enough hydrochloric acid? And there's a wide variety of reasons that this can come about, and it's very common. But the most common reasons seem to be either a lack of minerals needed. The body needs minerals to be able to make this hydrochloric acid. So resources are required for the body to be able to produce this hydrochloric acid, but also we need enough hydrochloric hydrochloric acid to break down our food correctly to get the minerals and resources out of that food so the body has what it needs. So a person can get stuck in this cycle of broken digestion for years or decades. And another major underlying cause that is very common seems to be a person being stuck in this sympathetic fight or flight state of the autonomic nervous system. And this is just a system in the body that kind of runs a lot of the show behind the curtains and we should be able to move back and forth between our parasympathetic rest and digest state and our sympathetic fight or flight state, depending on the circumstances that the body is presented with. But if someone's always stressed or their body is always stressed, they can get stuck in this sympathetic state and it's hard for them to move into this parasympathetic state where their body can produce this hydrochloric acid. So if you want to understand this a little bit more and steps you can take to improve these situations, click on the link on the screen or in our pinned comment of this short for our full video on why can't my body make hydrochloric acid.